I'm Larry Anglesana reporting for AvWeb and Kip Planes Magazine. You know, if you're building a basic VFR experimental aircraft or maybe even upgrading the panel on a basic LSA, you probably don't need all the advanced features found in flagship certified audio panels, but you probably do want wireless Bluetooth and music capability, to name a couple of functions. Now, both Garmin and PS Engineering offer non-certified versions of their flagship audio panels, but are priced and featured to better suit the cabins of a LSA and experimental. Now, in this video, I put three of these panels on my test bench, PS Engineering's PDA360EX, the PMA5000EX, and Garmin's GMA240, for a look and listen at some of the major features and their overall performance. Garmin's non-certified stereo audio panel is the $850 GMA240. Now, it borrows some function and ergonomics from the earlier generation GMA340, and has some resemblance to the current production GMA350C. Now the GMA240 has LED eliminated push button controls which have a high quality and positive feel. Now rotary knobs on the left and right side of the bezel control the pilot, co-pilot, passenger volume, and squelch stress hold. The pilot's rotary knob serves double duty as a power control, or the unit can be switched on and off with an avionics master switch, of course. Now, the 240 has a function called Master Avionics Squelch, or MASK. That's internal processing circuitry, which helps to reduce ambient noise inherent with VHF radios. MASK isn't a substitute for the panel's adjustable squelch control, but instead is always working in the background to reduce noise. As expected, each microphone on the intercom has a dedicated voice-activated circuit to ensure only the active microphone is heard with an open squelch. What's missing on the 240 is a standard crew isolation mode to separate the back seats from the front, an issue which doesn't really apply to two-seat LSAs, of course, unless it's configured with additional wiring. But in doing that, crew isolation also eliminates pilot isolation functionality. Some other features, including gain levels, are enabled with internal jumpers and potentiometers. You might want to talk to your shop before you have one wired so they can configure it to your liking. Now, one feature I like in the 240 is the monitor mode. Controlled with a dedicated bezel key, it mutes the audio from a secondary receiver when the primary radio receives incoming audio. So, in other words, you might be listening to an ATIS broadcast on the second comm radio, but receive a radio call on the primary. Monitor mute can work as a backstop for not missing calls. The GMA240 provides for two wired stereo inputs controlled with a Music 1 and Music 2 switch. The GMA240 accommodates three unswitched audio inputs which have configurable volume levels. These can be used for traffic and terrain system, engine monitoring and landing gear advisories and other attention getting alerts. There's also two auxiliary inputs switched on the front of the bezel. Plugged into PS Engineering's PDA360EX. Now the 360EX is a descendant of the company's flagship PMA450 audio panel which is equipped with PS Engineering's Intella Audio technology. Other than its price at 1995, it's worth noting that the 360EX differs slightly from the flagship PMA450 in that it has a four-seat intercom instead of the six-place in the PMA450. It also doesn't have marker beacon functionality, can't support a cabin speaker, and has no public addressing capability. PS Engineering tried hard to simplify the user interface in the 360EX. It uses an LCD bezel display, but also retains traditional push buttons and a rotary volume knob for radio switching and basic intercom settings. Now this display is also useful for configuring the Intella Audio dimensional sound function in the 360EX. That's known as head-related transfer. This is essentially an on-screen graphic that shows where the sound is positioned relative to your head. You can turn the Intella Audio off and on and listen to the audio in a traditional manner through the Intella Audio soft key on a display. I think PS Engineering has always taken entertainment and telephone input to a higher level, and the 360EX is no exception with its built-in Bluetooth transceiver. The feature set includes an on-screen Bluetooth telephone control, plus a bezel-mounted USB port that can be used to charge your smartphone or iPad. It outputs 5 volts DC and 1.5 amps of current. <laughs> I wish the 360EX had a dedicated volume control on the unit's bezel, but it doesn't. You have to go into a menu to get that. Simply hold the music in, music volume, and music one is Bluetooth, which is what we're listening to now. 
and the rotary knob changes the level of the music. Then a dedicated music on off switch turns the music on or off. Finally, PS Engineering's PMA 5000 EX is a lot like the company's certified PMA 8000B. It's also a direct slide-in for Garmin's GMA 240 and GMA 340 audio panels. Now, unlike the PMA 8000B, the 5000 EX uh, only has a four-seat intercom, doesn't have marker beacons, a cabin speaker interface, and also doesn't have a built-in digital readback recorder. Now, what I really like about the 5000 EX is the ability to adjust the music input from the front bezel. Uh, two bezel keys for up volume and down volume make it easy to adjust the volume. Now, like the certified 8000B, the 5000 EX has a straightforward user interface. It's got uh, crew and pilot isolation, music entertainment input muting, and a simple rotary volume control knob for a pilot and passenger volume. Now, if I had to select one of these panels, it would probably be the PS Engineering PDA 360EX for its advanced feature set. But at $19.95, you'll pay for it. Now, on the other end of the spectrum is Garmin's GMA 240 at $850. Now, Garmin hinted at a replacement for the 240. I'll get a look at that when it's available. In the meantime, for more, you can read a full report on these panels in the March 2016 issue of Kit Plains Magazine. Reporting for Kit Plains and Abweb, I'm Larry Anglesano. Thanks for watching.